hello, hello. Hi, it's Colleen with Chocolate Tour. How is everybody? Hope you're having a fantastic day. It's Thursday. We're almost there. We're almost to Friday. Woohoo! So excited. It's been a long week. I am ready for it to be Friday. So excited about that. Look what we've got. Look at this beautiful transfer. It's a big one. Stars and stripes. How awesome, right? It's got some amazing pieces to it. So we're going to use a few of the pieces from this. And you may remember that I had my star cutouts up here in my bookcase. And I did a project a bit ago with, um, with Mod Podge and napkins from the dollar store on the one side of these. So we're gonna use the other side because they're double-sided, which is most of Chomp's product is double-sided. So we're gonna do the other side tonight with the transfer. So let's jump in. I'm gonna go a little out of my comfort zone. I very, very rarely use um, shimmer gold. So I thought, let me pull out the catalog and I want to see how they did um, the star when they created with it. And I kind of want to create how they created it, sort of. So I kind of used their inspiration, sort of, for how I created that. I went a little rogue. But then I kind of want to create the big star, much like they did in the catalog, and use gold and shimmer red. So I think I'm going to do that, but I'm not going to quite do the same that they did here. I'm going to go a little different than that. Um, so I think that's what I'm going to do. So we'll make the firecrackers red and the rust shimmer gold. So let's do that. That should be pretty easy peasy. So let's get our transfer off. And again, we're going on a wood surface, so wood... We don't need to trans and we don't need to fuzz. So let's just go ahead and place our, this is a rather large one. Let's make some room over here. Move my glasses, move my water. Slide that over there. There we go. Now we've got a little room to move. We're gonna just go ahead and put our transfer on here. Do I have this here? Let's see, there we go. There we go. I'm just gonna line it up, try to get it in there so that we've got the transfer covering the star. And voila. Okay. And I think what I'll do is I'm gonna get my shimmer red going first and cover all of the uh, firecrackers. So, I think I might use, I think I might use a multi-tool for this because it's got the perfect little edge to it. So let's do that. Let's do that, hold on, I need, I need my, I need to see this again real quick because they did do the lines. Okay, they did the lines too. I just wanted to double check that. They did the lines in red. Okay, so let's just grab some of the crimson on here. And they came in and they just did the firecrackers. I probably should have masked off That probably would have been smart to mask off the rest so that I didn't accidentally get any red on it. Okay, there's one. 
Yeah, that would have made it a little easier so that I didn't accidentally get any red on some of the parts that need to be silver, but that's okay. If we have little boo-boos here and there, it's not the end of the world. Again, I'm just doing the firecrackers in the red and then the rest is going to be gold so that's all we're doing and the lines too the lines coming from the firecrackers I'm going to do those red as well I think that's got a little too much chalk paste on there. Alrighty. Got just a tip of one over here. He's kind of hiding out on the corner over here. Got a line. And then what I'll do is once I have these done, I'm just going to pull the transfer off and then it'll be easy to just come in and do the gold on the rest. I think. Okay. We'll get the harder one out of the way first. The other two, the smaller ones, are going to be easy. They're just going to be one solid color. So they'll be easy peasy. But this is hard it's just like coloring you just have to kind of color in the lines that's all just takes a little a little patience is all so fortunately nothing exciting at work today all was back to normal after the excitement that we had the other day so I was happy for that so it was back to work as normal so that was good okay just making sure I got all the lines that were coming from my little firecrackers I think we did okay I think we did so now I can just pull pull that off okay perfect all right cool all of the firecrackers are on there so let's dry that real quick and then I can lay that back down. I want to make sure I kept that the same orientation so I put that back down. Let's dry that real quick and then I can lay that right back down and then I can just cover it. The rest will just be all gold right on top. That'll be the easy part. This just takes just a little bit longer to dry just because it is the, um, the shimmer colors. Oops, I got a little bit on my finger. That's already dry. Make sure this is pretty decently dry before I put the transfer back down. Let's see. Okay, that feels pretty good. 
I don't know why I just blew on it. That's not gonna really do anything. That was kind of silly. All right, let's lay that there. Cause I'm gonna be using the red again, but I don't. I don't think I'm gonna need the multi tool, but just leave that there for a second. All right, let's line this back up. track here where are we I think that is I think I'm a little off here come on I mean it doesn't have to be perfect because I'm not trying to match things back up to go over it but I just don't want to accidentally hit I'm just going to make sure I get it perfect. I'm sorry. Just bear with me while I get this on here. Make sure I'm not off the star. I'm on there correctly. Okay. I think that's on there good. There we go. I think I got it. I just moved it. Darn it. Stuck to my finger and I moved it. Okay, I think we're good. we're good we can go with our gold now yay all right let's get that opened and oh wow that got a little that got a little haven't used this in a while let's get a story stick that got a little interesting did i just use this recently i'm having a brain cramp i think i just tried to use this recently didn't i don't remember now. I think I did. Hmm. Alright, well we're gonna try it. Cause this one's been sitting on the shelf for a while. Trying to watch where I'm not trying to not go over the red. And the paste, it feels a little, mm, it's a little thick. I probably should have maybe added some water. Uh, I'm going to try to pull this down and see what's going on before I continue. I want to make sure that this isn't too thick. Let's 
see what's going on here. I might need to add some water. No, I mean, it's coming out, but I definitely think it needs it. Let me just stop real quick. I think it needs water. Let me just get this off. Now that I started in this section here, I gotta kind of finish. Let me just get this section finished and lift it up. And then I'm gonna stop and add water. Cause it's a little faint. Cause I think it's too thick for the um, silk screen. So let me just finish this section right here and peel back and let's see what happens. Okay. Oops, I missed a spot here. I mean, it's coming out. It's just, I think it's, I need to add some water. Let me stop real quick. Let us try some of water. Let's see if that helps. Let's see if that works. because this is starting to hurt my hand. I've got a stiffer, sturdy stick here. On my multi-tools, that will work a lot better. I think that stick with the arthritis kind of tends to hurt the hand a little bit. This works a little bit better. it up and try that again shall we finish this off here all right that's gliding much better now that we added a little water get that in there so much quicker now. Okay. Let's get this little section down here and then we can pull this side over and be done this side. That's done. Oops. Almost finished. Sorry. My water bottle on the way there. Looks really good. Almost there. I 
like I said, I'm not typically a red and gold kind of kind of person, but it looks pretty good. Okay, I think we've got just about everything covered. Just got the tip right here, right there. I think we are good. Alrighty. There we go. We're going to put this. we go. Sorry that took a little longer than I had anticipated, but came out pretty good. All things considered, I love the red and gold on it. So we have the chalk on the one side and then the Mod Pod napkin on the other. So that came out really cute. Loving that. We'll leave that there. I'm probably going to wind up knocking that over. You know what? That's probably not smart. I'm going to set that over here to dry. So let's move it along to our next one. I think we're done with gold. So I'm gonna set that right here on top of this transfer. We'll close the gold up because I am going to go with, let's see, let's refer to the picture. So they did, oh, they did, let me get a napkin because I got a little bit of gold on my finger. They did um, the stars in blue, which I love. So I think we will recreate that on the smaller. Oh, wait. Hang on a second. I think I can only do one. I think I want to do the, the stars in blue. So I think I'm going to do that. I'll do the blue stars on here. Okay, I didn't want to do the red from the catalog. I definitely I want to do that. So I guess I will do, maybe I'll do the words in red. Wait, will that fit on here? Let me see. Is it this one? Yeah, I think I can do this one. The land of free, will that fit on here? Perfect, that's the one I wanted. Perfect, that one will fit on here. Now, the only question is, should I do this in blue and do the stars in red? Hmm. That's the only thing I'm not sure of. Which one to do? <laughs> Let's see, I did that in red. I think, I think I'm still going to go with what I originally said. I think I'm still going to do the stars in blue and the words in red. So let's do that. Grab another squeegee. Come over here. Another squeegee, and we'll do this in blue. How pretty. And this, like I said, will be so much quicker because we don't have all that detail. It's just going to be slide it right across. Just one color. Easy peasy. That's it. Not too bad. Let that take a minute and a half, maybe. Pretty, oh, 
missed a little, little tip right here. There we go. Now we got it. Okay. Get all that excess back into my jar because we are done with the blue. Close that up. I'll have any on my fingers. That's a bonus. Look, guys. So easy. Love it. Oh, that's gorgeous. Oh, and it's so shimmery. So pretty. You've got the shimmer, and then you've got the napkin on the other side. So awesome. Okay, let's do that to the side. Now we're going to come in with the red. I'm going to get a bigger squeegee for this one. Okay. And we're moving on. really fast. Okay. Big squeegee for the win. And you just, you really barely need any um, of the shimmer, sh uh, the shimmer paste for this. So nice. So, so nice. I'm kind of obsessed with the shimmers right now as you might be able to tell all right so I better squeegee some of this back off so I can put more into my jar okay right back in you go all righty close her up here so we can take it off and voila there we go so pretty just set that down I can try not to wear any on my white shirt okay that's it oh and it's all shiny love it so there we have it one please don't fall two, three. Oh, and if you could have seen the way the sun was just hitting that, it was like ricocheting off of there, off of all the shimmers. So there they are. How adorable. I just have to dry them. I don't want them to fall over because they're not dry yet. But then they come out so cute for the 4th of July coming up love them so these guys are in our um awesome summer celebrations catalog this little beauty right here the celebration suite that you may have seen on my chalk site um which you may or may not be aware that we actually have another catalog coming very, very soon in July, early July, guys. It'll be our um, autumn winter catalog. So um, a lot of what you're seeing in our catalogs that are out right now are not gonna be around for very long with the new catalog about to come out very soon. So just wanna throw that out there, make you aware that a lot of these beauties, um, you know, aren't going to be around for very much longer. So just keep that in mind. Um, but I hope you enjoyed tonight's project. You'll be seeing it on my shelf for a little while until um, at least the 4th of July and we change it out. These will be my display. These top two will be my displays for um, projects that I work on for holiday things, for current things and, um, you know, current catalogs. That'll be, you know, kind of my favorite projects that I've done out of current catalogs so that you can um, share them with me for things that I've created in my lives. 
Um, so thanks again for watching. If you're watching the replay, I thank you so much and I appreciate your um, hanging in there with me. Have a fantastic rest of your Thursday night and I will see you back here tomorrow for another project. I actually, I think I may make a pennant banner um, display using this transfer for the 4th of July. So I think I'm going to make five of these using these transfers. So stay tuned for that for tomorrow. So I hope to see you then. Bye.